Hi, I'm Sergeant Marin Spidell with the Dover Police Department. Today I'd like to tell you five key things about the new hands-free device law. The law includes any handheld electronic device, not just cell phones, but GPS devices, iPads, tablets, iPods, anything capable of producing not just voice communication, but data communication as well. Number two, reporting an emergency is a recognized exception. If you're driving down the road and you need to report an emergency that's ongoing, you can call 911 or call a police or fire department directly and report that emergency. Number three is a question that many people will ask. What if I'm stopped at a red light or a stop sign? Is it okay to quickly communicate on a cell phone at that point? The answer is no. You actually have to pull over out of traffic into a legal spot and safely communicate at that point. If you're stopped at a red light or a stop sign, you're still in traffic. And if you're in the travel lane, that's still illegal according to the law. Number four, the device has to be completely hands-free. The only allowance is to use one hand to either activate or deactivate a function of the telephone, typically to begin a process of using hands-free. Some people that have Apple products have asked me, what about Siri? Can I use Siri? Technically, you can use Siri. The problem is, once you activate Siri, the device has to be completely hands-free from that point on. And number five, if you're under the age of 18, all devices, including hands-free devices, are prohibited. Those under the age of 18 cannot use any type of electronic communication device while driving a vehicle.